Although the exercise is going on smoothly, the response by members of the community is poor. We have uh, spread over 9,000. The program has been going on well, but the other problem again is the people who didn't receive the mosquito nets. Last time, this time they are thinking that after you have spread their home, then it means they want to get the mosquito net. But we have tried to explain to them that uh, the government actually decided to not to do the, the, the two interventions at once. Those who received the mosquito nets like last year, are those where there was no access for the vehicle to pass. So it appears uh, the, the people are more concerned, they want nets as opposed to having their homes spread. One of the residents whose house was spread echoed the importance of the exercise. For the news, Miriam Mwinda reporting in Chisali District. In Central Province, Mukoshi Town Council has recorded a maize bumper harvest. The local authority cultivated a 13 hectares maize field at a cost of 118,000 kwacha and has harvested over 800 by 50 kilogram bags of maize. Joseph Siambihi now reports. The local authority in Mukoshi district engaged itself in maize production in the previous farming season. Having cultivated uh, maize, the local authority in the district has uh, produced at least 800 by 50 kg bags of maize. We join in the public relations officer who gives us more details about this issue. It costed the council a total of about 118,000 that was invested in this particular project. In this project, the main focus was uh, cultivation of maize. The idea behind was to set this particular project as a pilot, especially that it was the first of its kind in the district. As a local authority, our aim was to reap at least 170,000 kwacha plus at the end of this farming season. And uh, as you can see right behind me, what we are doing is that we are selling this particular maize to the FRIA and uh, I think the cost is about 150 kwacha and so far we have refined a total of about 860 bags. We are yet to know the total number of bags that we refine by the end of uh, August. Only then will we know whether or not we have made a profit or not. Meanwhile, other farmers in the district have continued advising their fellow farmers to sell the maize to the food reserve agency because of the appealing maize price, essentially, this year. This coming season, the local authority intends to diversify by engaging in wood production as well as sardines, as compared to what they did last year, where they cultivated a maize. Reporting for Zanis News in the district, I'm Joseph. We continue with 